<coughs> there's a old time Christian revivals piece of music called I am well in my soul or something like that and they're basically saying all is well in my soul and it's sort of in the refrain the point is that a person like me who's homeless people presume it's all kind of crazy in their soul and I'm not most of the time I'm at peace the time that I get out of peace is when people come in and piss on me just like anyone would be dis in discord you see discomfort is what people like to do to people who are homeless and you sit there and you wonder and go who the hell made you in other words what is your maker on one hand in other words who is the deity that you believe in and what is your life philosophy as a man or a woman and the next thing you're asking is, who brought you up? Who raised you? Did you get raised in a barn? Are you really that stupid about life? Or do you really not get how to be a socially appropriate individual in a community? A socially appropriate individual in a community does not steal from someone. A socially appropriate individual in a community does not harm someone. A socially appropriate individual in a community doesn't try to be a bruiser or a bitch to anyone. And a socially appropriate person in any neighborhood or any community regards human life plain and simple this is not rocket science if you regard your own life then you must regard other people's lives and if you regard your own privacy then you must be willing to regard other people's privacy if you're a real soothsayer like me then you're always speaking truth but you still have moments in your life that have privacy but if you're a long time liar like other people I've met then good luck because nobody believes in anything you say anyway so nobody gives a shit about your privacy. I talk a lot about medical rights because I have had major abuses during the last five years of my privacy and medical rights with regard to my own human dignity that are completely protected by world treaties and yet local people, local law enforcement, state and others think they have rights to me that they do not have under any federal law in the land. There are certain parts of us that are untouchable by other people underneath the federal laws that protect our people, the human rights that we tout in the world, and the constitutional amendments that protect every man, woman, child, boy, and girl 